make huge money on Etsy and eBay with $1 bills, lazy method. In this video, we're gonna show you some examples of incredibly rare banknotes and coins that are selling for a ton of money online. Make sure you sit tight and let's hop into this video. So up first, we have a $1 bill from 2013 that's currently on Etsy right now for $50,000. They're saying this is a holy grail of a collector's item. It's a rare find and you don't wanna miss it whatsoever. So this person does have a pretty rare banknote, but is it worth $50,000? Please be very careful whenever buying or selling on eBay or Etsy. There's a lot of false information online, specifically Etsy, where things like this can happen. Now let's go to this example. This is the same type of banknote. It's a descending ladder that sold on a legitimate auction website called Heritage Auctions. Now like we said, the $1 bill is rare, but is it $50,000 rare? Well, this example is one grade higher. The previous one was a 65, this is a 66. Grade will increase the value if it's higher. This example sold for $1,000. $398. Now don't get me wrong, that's a lot of money for a $1 bill, but it's not $50,000. The person that put it on Etsy, very lazy, and to be quite honest, maybe they're trying to hit a home run. You know, they're trying to rip someone off and scam them, or they simply just don't know the value. That's why it's really important to understand how much your collectibles are really worth before you go ahead and try to sell them like this person's doing, because that's a complete ripoff. All right, so we have two $1 bills here for $50,000. What do you know? It's the same guy on Etsy that think he's got something rare. So one of the bills is a star note in the other one, I see nothing going on with it whatsoever. He does have it in a nice little holder there, keeping him really safe. Okay, so what the person is trying to go for here is the serial numbers. They're saying that they are a rare date. They're saying that the first one is a July 4th, 1776 star note, and the second one is a July 4th, 1976 banknote. So they're just saying that the 7 is July, the 4 is the day, and 1976 and 1776 is the year. Okay, kind of cool, I get it, but not $50,000 worth. Now this example right here is super cool. These are two genuine $20 bills that had a genuine sale. That means the sale went through, the buyer paid a total of $36,000. Now, how did this happen? This is what we call a duplicate serial number. So this never ever happens in the Bureau of Engraving and Printing where they produce paper money, but somehow it happened. You have the same exact banknote. So this is a great thing that you can look for while it's really challenging to come across. If you have the same exact serial number on any sort of bill, even if you have a $1 bill and a $20 bill with the same serial number, that's really cool. That's something to look after because these two $20 bills from 1974 sold for $36,000. All right, this person is selling two pieces of 100 gram, 24 karat gold on Etsy. When I'm looking at this, there's seven views in the last 24 hours. Now we're gonna go to a website called Appmex. Now this website is very reputable, very trustworthy. You're gonna get a pretty good deal on whatever sort of bullion that you're buying. Now they're selling a 100 gram gold bar, which is the same thing as the previous Etsy example we're showing you except they're selling it at the time of me making this video for $6,819.30. That could go up or down based upon the market, but it just goes to show that the person that put it on Etsy is completely trying to rip someone off. Now, the probability of someone dropping 36 grand on two pieces of 100 gram worth of gold is slim to none. Hopefully, if you have that sort of money, you're not gonna make that sort of a risk without doing a little bit of homework and research. Just please do some research before you spend money or try to sell something online. You don't wanna be given false information out there. That's the last thing you want to do. Last up, we have a coin on Etsy. Now, there's only three of them left, and they're in 20 people's carts. That means there's 20 people out there that think this is a really rare coin. So, it's a 2003 Finland coin, two euros. They have it listed for $11,457.38. That's completely bogus. When you go over to eBay, you can see the same exact coin sold recently for about $5.50 plus about $8.50 worth of shipping. So, nowhere near the 11.4k that we saw previously. Guys, be very careful on eBay and Etsy. There's a lot of scams out there. I like that we show the fake stuff and the real stuff because people are just trying to take advantage of us out there. That's why it's important to do your homework, do your research. Now listen, we have a completely free ebook that we recently updated down below. You can check that out. It's going to help you a ton. Let's go ahead and click on that link, get that completely free, and we'll see you in the next video.